Steiner of LegendaryReviews.com. Today, I'm going to be giving you guys a little overview of uh, Cyberlink Power Director 10. If you do not know, Cyberlink Power Director 10 has came out. I've had it for a few months. Haven't really had uh, much of a chance to mess around with it that much. But I do expect on doing a new tutorial series on Cyberlink Power Director 10. I'm not sure how many videos I'm going to do of it. But it's definitely much more different than Cyberlink Power Director 9 was. And I'm just going to give you a quick overview. This is going to be a short video. And, um, well, this is basically what you see when you um, start the program. You get a little uh, welcome screen, which is obviously different. Something they haven't done in the, and, um, in the past. And here is just the editor. Um, I haven't really got to mess with these. I got to mess with this. But um, Slideshow Creator is already in the full editor. So uh, it's not really that useful having that right there. Um, I'm just going to show you the, the full editor. It looks a little different. doesn't look too different. They've added a few new features. Not, not too many new features. But one big thing about Cyberlink uh, 10 is that it has 3D capabilities now. And you, make, you can make 3D videos with it. But this only works if you have 3D glasses. Now first, I'm just going to start with uh, the transitions. They've added many new transitions. They've added 3D transitions. Um, you know, these are a few new transitions. Cyberlink has always been pretty good for having a really decent amount of transitions and pretty good looking ones. And these are some of the new ones. They've also added this new thing, um, audio transitions. And this is really great, uh, especially for, let's say me, like in this video, I'm definitely, when I make this video, I am going to use an audio transition. And what I'm going to do is, in between the intro and, ten, and when it goes to talking to, to me talking, um, it kind of like does uh, a crossfade in between the intro music and me talking. And it makes it a really good transition into me talking, and it sounds very great. This is um, definitely one of my favorite features in Cyberlink Power Director 10 so far. It makes things much more easier. And um, besides the 3D um, transitions, they haven't added too many others. But um, as you can see, they organized it here on the side. That wasn't like that before. Back then, it just showed you all the transitions. But here, it just you know breaks it down into uh, different types of transitions. That's basically about it. Uh, don't forget to go to LegendaryReviews.com for game reviews, downloads, and much, much more. I'll see you guys later in my new Cyberlink Power Director 10 tutorials.